Hi, it's Felicia Slattery at communicationtransformation.com and signaturespeechsecrets.com. My friend Nancy Marmalejo asked me to say hello to you, and I hope you enjoy your weekend at I Heart My Biz event. So, hi, and enjoy your weekend. And as a teacher myself, I have to tell you just three quick tips to make your time at I Heart My Biz really excellent for you, both at the event and later. Hope that's okay. Tip number one, take loads of pictures. Pictures of you with the other attendees, pictures of you with the instructors and faculty members, pictures of you and Nancy. I know she's busy, but she can pause to go, (laughs) <laughs> that doesn't take long. So make sure you take loads of pictures. This is called social proof. It proves that number one, you're out of the house. Number two, you're investing in your own learning. You're investing in your success. And number three, one, two, three, there we go. <laughs> Nobody ever pays me to do math. <laughs> and number three, you are able to really leverage those relationships after the event is over by showing people, hey, look who I've met, look who I know. Okay, so number one, take lots of pictures. Number two, never eat alone. And in addition to this, don't be going to bed at 10 o'clock at night, (laughs) okay? You're out of the house for goodness sakes. You're at a live event. You're mixing and mingling with other people. Do not spend time by yourself unless you really need some focus time. But I strongly encourage you to take the focus time immediately after the event or right before you go to bed or maybe right when you wake up in the morning. But truly, do not have breakfast, lunch, or dinner by yourself. You are at the event. You're out of the house. You can meet people, talk to people, network. You may never know who is your next joint venture partner. They could be sitting right next to you and you'll never know it because you didn't have lunch with them. So that's number two. Finally, number three, be willing to share some of your secrets. Okay, why? Because if people don't know who you are and they don't really know what you're about and you're not sharing with them, you're not freely helping them, they're not going to know how you might be able to work with them. Again, as a joint venture partner, maybe they might be interested in becoming an affiliate for you. Maybe they're someone who could potentially be a client or a customer of yours, but they'll never know if you're so closed guarded and you don't share freely of yourself. So three tips for your success at the event. I hope you have a wonderful time. Nancy, I'm sure it is fabulous. Hi to my other friends, Michelle PW and Shannon Cherry and Mary Pat Cavanaugh. Have a great time, everybody. Bye. It's Felicia Slattery again, communicationtransformation.com.